everyone, this is Sanzilla. Normally, a subscriber of mine called Nanny Snap does this sort of thing. Nanny Snap reviews, and then the title of the movie. Well, he's gone on vacation, and he hasn't reviewed this movie that I'm about to review for you all, so I decided to kind of take over this week. Don't be, don't be mad, Teddy. Mad pop. Your idea. Alright, so the movie that I'm reviewing is called Perfume, Story of a Murderer. Now, it takes place in the 1970s. Really, really, actually, is this the 1970s? No. No, it's not the 1970s. My bad. It's, um, I could have actually mixed that up around. I forget, but it's said to have, it, it's, taken place from a long, 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 long time ago. Well, for me, it's a long time ago. Then again, I think 20 years is a long time. Well, the movie is about this, this, this child, this, this baby, who's born with an extraordinary scent. And it just sort of follows his life, kind of from, from birth to, to death. Um, it's not, it's, a good, it's a good average size movie, and um, because he he can smell just like everything. He can be like miles and miles and miles away from someone who has bad body odor, and he can follow their scent. He has extraordinary, like he's wicked good. He can all. Uh, then, eventually, he becomes obsessed with this one scent. The scent of, uh, this beautiful red-headed girl. Whom he accidentally kills. With an accident. Um, but he becomes obsessed with preserving the scent and putting it in, in, in a form that, that he could just smell all the time. Well, he finds a way. And so, in order to create the most perfect scent... And the scent is pure love. You dab it on and people will love you. That's how powerful this thing was. Um, he had to kill, uh, like, 12, no, 15, no. He had to kill a lot of beautiful women. Um, I would suggest seeing that it's, a uh, it's pretty disturbing. Um, it's messed up and every single way, but it was a, it was an awesome movie, very clever, very well done, I was, I was just, I was blown away by it, it was an awesome movie, um, now, it stars Rick Allen, Dustin Hoffman, and, uh, that, the that, that girl who played Wendy in Peter Pan, I forget her name, um, but really, it was a worthwhile, it was a worthwhile movie to see. I highly recommend it. And, um, it was a fun time. Alright, so until Nani Snap returns with more reviews, this has been Babzilla, and I hope you all enjoy. Go and see Perfume, Story of a Murder. Bye!